What's up, guys? <laughs> and girls. <laughs> the second trailer for One Division, which comes out soon, has been out. We got requests to watch it. Let's just get into it. Cool beans. Cool beans. Cool beans. Cool beans. <laughs> cool beans. So what's a single gal like you doing rattling around this big house? It looks well, just I like I Love Lucy. Married. Yeah, it does. To a man, a human one. One. We are an unusual couple. Hmm. Oh, I don't think that was ever in question. It's like bewitched. Yeah. We just don't know what to expect. That's interesting. <laughs> Howdy, neighbors. Hey, buddy. Oh, yeah. So funny. Who are you? I don't know. I think something's wrong here. Wanda, can you read me? Who's doing this to you? Are you here to help us? <laughs> this is our home. Then let's fight for it. Super interesting. Well, I think we handled that well. Interesting. I like that they. Disney Plus. I like that Marvel is using their um, the MCU characters to explore different like mediums of selling stories. You know, kind of like this Pleasantville. Yeah. <laughs> Who's seen Ple Pleasantville? That movie is so funny. Except they're also, like, trying to figure out what's going on with them, you know? Mm -hmm. I, I really like what Disney Plus is doing. They, yeah. I think, I mean, Netflix obviously has, like, really, like, all competing, set the no? bar for, for, like, streaming content. And Amazon HBO is doing... HBO Max is... Well, HBO Max barely has any, like, original programming right now. Yeah, but it's gonna... But all the, like... My point is Mandalorian, all of the like Falcon Winter Soldier, the Loki series, and One Division. Like, these are all going to be like high budget, high concept. Like, they're not just like Stranger. Th for example, Stranger Things is a great show. Yeah. But you don't need like you can go a lot farther with the budgets that they're putting on these Marvel shows. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's, I think I think they're they're putting their movie budgets behind these series, which makes sense because well, you like know HBO Max too. Right, but HBO Max is just getting Warner Brothers twenty twenty one slate. So what's happening is that they're just getting movies that were supposed to be in theaters are now getting released simultaneously on HBO Max. So, as opposed to, you know. Yeah, but that's huge. That is huge, Movies but that was like an intention. In that was an intentional. Is my is my point? Disney intended to have high dollar series that only released on the Disney Plus platform, as opposed to we shot this movie and you know they did it. They did it with Milan because they had to, but they charged more money. Where that and that's where HBO Max is going to be different. Maybe we'll see in the future. But you know, Wonder Woman nineteen eighty four was an extra money. Yeah. So that was interesting. But I mean, I'm excited I love both for it. platforms, so. I love every I'm excited. platform. Yeah. I, like, we, we love shows on every single platform. Yeah. I love Jack Ryan. I loved 000 on Amazon Prime. I loved. Um, I haven't watched a lot on Apple TV, but I know that there's some really good content on there. There's mm -hmm. a series with Reese Witherspoon that's on there that's really good. Um, we Netflix watch that. obviously has amazing content. And Disney Plus has The Mandalorian and all of these coming out. So, like, it's no question that every single platform has something worth watching. But let us know. What I you miss guys. watching Grogu. Yeah, we miss Grogu. We have. I'm excited for season three. Gro Groga. That's gonna be a while though, right? Season three, Mandalorian. Uh, I don't know. Had a little. Anyways. Baja. Let us know what you guys thought in the comments a baja, down below. A baja is um, like lint. Awesome. 
And if you liked the video, please make sure to like, subscribe, and ring the notification bell. We'd really appreciate it. Yes, we would. Thank you guys for watching. Thanks, guys.